Hello guys and welcome to windowsreport.com. In this video I'm going to show you what to do in case Windows 10 does not recognize your second hard drive. In this video I'm going to show you a few methods or a few things that you should try to do in order to fix the problem. First of all I'm going to recommend you to run the hardware and devices troubleshooter and uh, this troubleshooter should help. To run it you're just going to have to press the Windows key and then type in here trouble and the best match will be troubleshoot. Click on it and Windows settings will be opened up. Here in the right side just go and scroll down a bit where it says hardware and devices. Click on it and click on run the troubleshooter. And this troubleshooter will run and will try to find the problems maybe with the drivers or maybe some physical problems that you can have on your hard drive that is not detected by Windows 10. If the troubleshooter didn't solve the problem, I'm gonna recommend you to check the status of the drive to see what's the problem exactly. So for that, you're gonna have to press the Windows key plus R and then type in here devmgmt.msc and then click on OK and the device manager will open up. Here you're gonna have to go and find disk drives and expand it and see all your disk drives that you have connected on your system. If you can find here your second hard drive, right click on it and click on properties and then see here the device status. If the device is not working properly, you can always go and right click on it and uninstall device and after that try reconnecting the hard drive. But also we can right click and uh, then click on update driver and like that Windows will automatically try to update the hard drive driver. So guys, I'm hoping that that this video helped you and you managed to fix the problem by trying these methods so this was the video guys don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel with the notification bell activated so you won't miss any future uploads also don't forget to leave a comment down below with problems that you have on your windows operating system and we can try to solve your issue in the next video until next time have a nice day